Welcome to the north portal of the Davao City Bypass Project Tunnel. So as you can see, uh, we have two lanes. And then uh, we also have two lanes on the other side. Today uh, we started the uh, kickoff for the tunneling of the south portal. You just heard DPWH Region 11 spokesperson Dean Ortiz on the ongoing tunnel activities of the Davao Bypass Tunnel. On the Public Works and Highways Unified Project Management Office Operations, which is implementing the Davao City Bypass Construction Project, now conducts simultaneous tunneling activities at the northbound and southbound directions on the North Portal of the project's road mountain tunnel component. DPWH Undersecretary and Build 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 Chief Implementer Emil Sadain said that the works for the North Portal's northbound direction is now underway that will ramp up project progress to catch up on the late arrivals of special equipment, machineries, and Japanese experts due to movement restrictions and delayed issuance of travel permits because of the COVID-19 pandemic. Included in the list of flagship infrastructure projects of the President Duterte's Build 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 program, the bypass road will mitigate congestions in Davao City, with the travel time between Barangay Sirawan in Turil District, Davao City, in Barangay GP Laurel in Panabo City from 1 hour and 44 minutes via the Pan-Philippine Diversion Road to be reduced into 49 minutes via Davao City Bypass Road. It is expected that the start-up of excavation work up the northbound direction of the North Portal will significantly speed up project delivery. Construction of the southbound direction meanwhile was earlier started on November 2021 and has more than 60 meters of road tunnel excavated with shot creek, steel ribs, and rock boards. The entire 45.5 km bypass road is divided into six packages. The group of Shimizu Ultikon Takenaka, led by Project Director Akira Mito, is undertaking the construction of Contract Package 1-1 covering 10.7 kilometers of four-lane highway and inclusive of the 2.3 kilometer tunnel that has a diameter of 10 meters. According to Yusek Sadain, the soon-to-be first ever long-distance mountain tunnel in the Philippines was designed to have better seismic resiliency. The tunnel was constructed using the new Austrian Tunneling Method, or NATM. The Davao City Bypass Construction Project is funded by the Japanese Official Development Assistance under the Special Terms for Economic Partnership, or STEP, loaned from Japan International Cooperation Agency. The next presentation is a short preview of the new Austrian tunneling method. The tunnel construction methodology used for the 2.3 km Davao Bypass Tunnel. The NATM, a standard method for building tunnels in mountainous areas, uses the geological stress from natural ground around a tunneling site to build a tunnel safely. In the construction of the Davao Bypass Tunnel, this method is used primarily in mountainous areas. The NATM uses machines and explosives to excavate natural ground. When using explosives, a machine called a drilling jumbo is used to drill into an excavation surface and fill it with explosives. Soil generated by blasting is carried off-site using a dump truck or belt conveyor. After excavation, concrete is sprayed onto excavated areas to reinforce natural ground. Rock bolts are then used to integrate the tunnel into natural ground. Depending on the conditions of the natural ground, arc-shaped steel material is used for reinforcement. 
is enable safe and efficient construction of a tunnel integrated into natural ground using the geological stress of surrounding soil. Excavation work can proceed at the front, while finishing work follows along the rear. Firstly, waterproofing sheets are laid to mitigate the impact of groundwater. Next, lining concrete and truck bed concrete are applied in that order. Tunnel construction is completed through these processes. The tunnel of the Yamanashi Maglev Line, which already offers passenger rides, was also built by the MATM. Don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell.